the news is here everyone the sims team has officially announced bunk beds and it looks like some other things as well i hope you guys are having an amazing week it's monday march 22nd what a wonderful start to the week and simmers including myself we are so hungry we are so starved for new content that any little droplet that we get boy we will just clamor to we will just bulldoze everyone down to just get that little droplet of content and I just feel like that's where most of us are at right now with this game and even though this update really isn't that big for some people I mean in my opinion it isn't that big to me I'm still running to it because it's something for a game that has far too many issues and that feels far too incomplete so now on to the news I'm gonna sit my opinion in the back of the room we're not gonna talk about that just yet we'll get to that a little bit later but the sims team tweets today March 22nd bunk beds check trait improvements check improved console textures check oh my god thank god I'm so happy they are finally 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 fixing that that's been an issue for how many months now the sims 4 update goes live tomorrow March 23rd at 10 a.m pacific time that's 1 p.m eastern time for all players which bunk are you fighting for the top bunk or the bottom sim guru bat and sim guru azure are excited to walk you through tomorrow's update tune in march 23rd at 11 a.m pacific time that's 2 p.m eastern time for another inside maxis on twitch.tv slash the sims to learn more on the latest update and what's coming to the sims 4 so if you don't know this little inside maxis thing i guess it's like their little maxis monthly it's like the new maxis monthly basically i don't know what happened to maxis monthly they just kind of debuted it did it a few times and then we're like all right i guess we're not doing it anymore and they just stopped for some reason so inside maxis is i guess the new maxis monthly in a way it's like where they give us like little previews of what's to coming or whatnot and that was what the last live stream was the one where they you know announced and teased the bunk beds in the first place so we're getting another one of those tomorrow at 11 a.m pacific time and then one hour before the live stream the update goes live so the update is coming before the live stream so if you don't even want to watch the live stream you don't have to if you guys want me to record it and put it up on my youtube channel because it is going to be on twitch i will definitely do that for you also instead of uploading it to the channel do you guys want me to do like another live reaction of it because you guys really liked when we did that last time last time they had a live stream we did a live reaction and we kind of talked and paused and watched through it at the same time i kind of want to do that also i figured out how to get my microphone fixed so there won't be any audio issues next time so let me know if you guys want something like that looking at the picture i'm not gonna lie i'm kind of excited for bunk beds we can't really see the animations but from the still that we see it looks pretty cool to me and judging by the rest of the picture it doesn't look like anything else is coming i really don't know if we'll be getting loft beds if we are getting loft beds we'll probably find out tomorrow i know that there was one sim guru i think it was sim guru mr e there was like some sort of hint at what could be a loft bed i'm gonna get into that in a second but um i just figured that i would mention that really quickly in this picture obviously it's just a bunk bed but maybe there are different variations and one of them is a loft bed who knows okay here's the tweet so it was actually tweeted march 21st actually last night who's excited for tomorrow we got the information you need to finally understand this mysterious image the mysterious image in question is the bunk bed obviously rest assured you gave us a lofty goal but we set out to debunk the myths and soon we will reveal all so do you think this is just you know him just basically joking around with bunk beds or do you think that we're also going to get loft beds too a loft bed is basically a bunk bed just without the bottom bunk so it's only a bed on the top and then a ladder and then you can place stuff underneath like a desk with a computer a mini fridge a dresser basically any kind of object hopefully they make it so that you can place interactable objects underneath as well do you think we'll be getting loft beds or do you think it's just bunk beds and he kind of throws in the word lofty just to i don't know go along with the theme of the bunk beds because bunk beds are still loft beds in a way because you have to climb up to the top bunk you know let me know down below what you think but of course it would not be a pixelate news and info video without showcasing the community's opinions before we move any further i'd like to put out a disclaimer any content news that can be accessed or seen by the public whether they be tweets posts videos blogs etc are included for discussion commentary criticism and news reporting purposes as allowed by law if information is not public knowledge permission will be requested please do not send hate or threats to anyone mentioned in this video the intent of this video is to report on the news one of the top responses actually comes from shaded plum bob spotted a new fixed hair so it looks like one of the hairs has been fixed or at least one
one of the hairs has been fixed. In the picture, you can see what it looks like now, and they follow up with another image if you're wondering. This is what it looks like as of right now in the game, credit to Sims Wiki. Yeah, they fixed it, thank God. You can tell the hair has a lot more texture to it, even though this is a low quality image, it's still noticeable. So really, really, really excited to see how this looks in game in full quality. Some of these top comments are a little brutal. Just gonna let you guys know now. Thank you for the bare minimum loves, X. Did I hear trait improvements? Good, 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 good. Yes, please improve the traits and how they affect our Sims. I'm surprised you didn't make The Sims 4 my first bunk bed kit. Where are my sectional couches? I've been waiting for like five years. Yeah, I'd love to have those. Trait improvements? Did y'all see the mismatching socks? All the people saying something like too little too late or thanks for the bare minimum and then hating on the people who are hyped for this. Can you just not? Maybe? Trait improvements sound nice, but it's still a little too late, babes. I will say that I am kind of worried because with how the base game is, I feel like even if they improve the traits or change how they affect, you know, your Sims personalities or whatever and how you play your game, I just feel like with the way that the base game is built, you know, the foundation of this game, I really feel like that isn't going to do much. And the reason why I say that is because we got so excited when Lifestyles and Sentiments came out, they really didn't feel like they changed gameplay too much, like in the long term. They were cute and fun at first, but they definitely didn't give us the impact that we had hoped from them. You know, I just feel like that's because of the base game and the foundation of it. Please stop wasting time and resources dragging this game out and work on Sims 5 instead. I want to comment on this actually. So they have multiple teams, so they can work on Sims 4. And there's also another team working on Sims 5 at the same time. These games do overlap. When The Sims 4 ends, it isn't going to be five years of nothing and then a new game comes because the same team is, you know, working on a new game. These projects are overlapping, so I can bet you 100% they're working on The Sims 5 right now as they're releasing content for The Sims 4. So in my opinion, we shouldn't be too concerned about that. The Sims 4 is starting to come out of its beta version. And Lil Simsy replies, OMG. All right, that's it, guys. If you want to look at the replies, go ahead over to Twitter and look beneath the tweets. There are plenty of replies, both positive and negative, satirical and scary. Basically everything that you're looking for is going to be there. So head over there and check that out. Let me know what you guys are thinking of this down in the comment section below. What are your thoughts? Are you excited? Are you not? Have you been wanting this in the game for years and are over the moon or do you not give a rat's tail? Let me know down in the comment section below. I love you guys so, so, so very much. Thank you for clicking and watching and I will see you all next time. So long and happy simming. Bye everyone.